Open AI now lets you buy directly inside chats, starting with Etsy and Shopify. For years, ChatGPT was where you search for answers. Now, it's actually where you swipe your card. With instant checkout, US viewers can buy from Etsy sellers today. And over 1 million Shopify merchants from Glossier to Skims are coming next. No redirects, no links. Just type, talk, tap, and it's yours. Etsy's stock jumped 7.3%. Shopify popped 4.5%. Clearly, Wall Street sees what's happening. This isn't a side feature. This is OpenAI muscling into Amazon territory. Stripe powers OpenAI's new agentic commerce protocol, now open sourced. The magic isn't just a button. It's a protocol. Co-developed with Stripe, the agentic commerce protocol is an open standard for AI commerce. Merchants don't need to rip up their back-end systems. They actually keep control, fulfillment, returns, and payments. ChatGPT simply acts as the middleman, securely passing details like a digital personal shopper. And here's the interesting part. It's actually open source. Which means tomorrow, anyone from Walmart to your neighborhood thrift shop could actually hook into ChatGPT's agentic checkout rails. OpenAI adds a new revenue stream without touching consumer prices. Merchants pay a fee on completed orders. Users, well, nothing extra. Prices stay the same. That's deliberate. OpenAI knows friction kills conversions. Free for consumers means more volume and more merchant fees flowing back into OpenAI's $12 billion revenue engine. If this sounds well familiar, that's because we reported on Pulse just weeks ago, OpenAI's proactive daily brief that hinted at becoming an ad surface. Now, combine that with commerce and you see the playbook. Search links to ads which points to buy. That's Google's trillion dollar model only, this time inside ChatGPT. Shopify calls it, well, a shift in commerce, end quote. Merchants can now meet customers directly inside AI conversations. Shopify's product head says it very bluntly. People are discovering products in AI chats, not search. If you ask ChatGPT, best running shoes under $100, Shopify's real-time inventory feeds right in. If checkout is enabled, well, you hit buy and it's done. Voila. That's revolutionary because it keeps merchants in control. Their name shows up, their systems handle fulfillment and their brand relationship stays intact. It's AI-powered discovery without seeding identity to Amazon. Agentic Commerce could spark a 10 to $20 billion iPhone-style AI shopping super cycle. Remember this, more than 700 million people use ChatGPT weekly. Even if a fraction start buying through chat, this is a whole new commerce channel. Analysts are actually already calling it a potential super cycle, the kind that once drove smartphone adoption. But there's always a risk. OpenAI must balance discovery, ads, and most importantly, trust. If users feel nudged towards products because of fees or ads, the magic breaks. That's why they're loudly stressing. Instant checkout doesn't influence ranking. Results remain organic. From Etsy crafts to enterprise deals, OpenAI is building the rails for agentic shopping. This isn't just about buying a mug on Etsy. This is OpenAI testing how far users trust an AI agent with their wallet. Pulse showed how ChatGPT could anticipate needs. Now Commerce shows it can fulfill them. Put the two together and you glimpse a future where your AI doesn't just recommend a running route. It also books your shoes, gels and recovery kit before breakfast. And let's remember this. As we reported here on front page, OpenAI 
isn't shy about monetization. Ads are coming. Commerce is here. The compute grid is being built. What started as a chatbot is morphing into an operating system for life. This is more than Etsy in ChatGPT. This is OpenAI quietly re-architecting the internet's checkout button, planting itself at the center of the next trillion dollar commerce cycle. Instant checkout isn't available in India as yet, even though India is OpenAI's second largest usage market and growing fastest globally. And that gap actually matters because when this drops in India, chat to discovery to purchase will basically compress from minutes to seconds, making ChatGPT not just a tool, but the default shopping interface for hundreds of millions. It shifts power from big marketplaces to whichever AI platform wins trust and reach. Because in a country where mobile first commerce already dominates, this move could actually flip the script. Search engines de-emphasized, marketplaces de-intimidated and chat GPT turned from companion to cashier. And let's be very, very clear. This doesn't just put OpenAI in Amazon's crosshairs. It actually puts them on a collision course with Misho, Flipkart, Ageo, Nika, Blinkit, Big Basket, every platform that defines Indian e-commerce today. Interesting times, I say. Thank you.